it uh, was a bit of a challenge uh, getting uh, enough songs to see it through and now yeah, seeing that most of them seem to only be about a minute and a half or uh, two minutes long but we got there in the end always great to hear uh, the surf music and I always um, think of uh, the Beach Boys uh, when the weather starts to get a little bit warmer Talking of uh, weather, we'll have a look at the uh, weather forecast for the next uh, three days here in the Wire Wairapa and uh, it's going to be a cracker. Uh, tomorrow, uh, minimum of five degrees, a top of 19. Fine with uh, north uh, southwesterlies rather easing. On Sunday, going to be a stinker. It's going to get to uh, 30 degrees. A fine and warm with light winds. And on Monday, uh, a top of 27 fine and warm with light winds and uh, certainly summer has arrived uh, particularly uh, here in the Wairapa over uh, the next uh, three days anyway. Just looking at the uh, rainfall I mentioned last week how uh, low it's been for September and the uh, Marston rainfall for the month of October was uh, 41.6 millimetres of rain against an average of 90 so uh, yeah it's certainly been uh, dry but uh, great conditions out on the farms and speaking of uh, farms and all things uh, rural I'll be uh, out in the heat over uh, the weekend the two days uh, down at the Clearville uh, Showgrounds uh, with the uh, Wire App uh, AMP uh, Society's uh, show. We've got a, um, a, uh, a milking cow, funny enough, called Daisy, but anyway, she's a milking cow, not a real one, it's a fiberglass uh, one. Apparently, you fill her up with water and you'll be able to uh, hand milk a cow, so it'll be a lot of fun uh, for the kids. And we've also uh, got what's uh, known as a uh, as the Fonterra barrel train. It's actually um, been made and is looked after by a uh, kind farmer up in the uh, Hawke's Bay and uh, it's a, um, a whole lot of uh, plastic barrels that have been uh, cut out, seats have been uh, put in there and uh, it's all towed by a ride on uh, lawnmower that I'll have to try to uh, master and uh, if you're coming to the show with the kids uh, please jump on the uh, train it's a gold coin uh, donation to uh, get on the train because the money raised from there is going to a uh, very very worthy uh, local charity this farmer that actually owns it uh, does have his uh, own uh, pet um, charities at the moment he's supporting uh, Ronald McDonald House but for uh, this weekend he is uh, quite happy for us to uh, support a uh, local um, fundraiser so uh, thank you very much for that uh, Philip and I'll uh, make sure I'll uh, try to look after uh, the train and not uh, run it into anything and of course the other thing we've got down there um, Mike's going to be down all day with a tanker so uh, he's uh, one of our uh, drivers and is one of our lead drivers so he knows all about uh, the Fonterra tankers and he'll uh, show you all the uh, magic technology that those uh, tankers certainly have <laughs> So an early start for me in the morning, which means I'm not staying up for the uh, rugby uh, tonight. I think it kicks off about uh, 10 or 11 o'clock, so I'm going to uh, my sky that and uh, look at it at some stage uh, over the weekend. When I get to uh, look at it, I'll obviously uh, know the score, but I just want to uh, see how uh, the All Blacks do go, particularly uh, as it's the last game for uh, many of those involved. Disappointing uh, result over the uh, last weekend, but you'd have to say that the uh, better team on the day certainly won. And uh, a few other things happening, there's a, um, a rugby league test um, tomorrow night, I think it is, uh, up in Auckland. Um, we are in a uh, tournament featuring uh, Tonga us and uh, Great Britain. I think we might be playing uh, Great Britain. 
So uh, plenty on uh, over the weekend, uh, good weather, so that means that you're able to do all those jobs outside, do them quickly and uh, build up a, uh, a little bit of time on hand and that means you might be able to pop down to uh, the showgrounds and have a look at uh, an AMP show. Whatever you do, uh, take care and take care during the week and we'll catch you uh, next Friday night at uh, 7 o'clock with the Blues Show and uh, 8 o'clock with the uh, 60s Nostalgia Show and for the Nostalgia Show next week I think I, uh, I might look back to um, the New Zealand uh, Top 10 uh, 50 years ago on uh, or around the uh, 9th of November. The reason for that is uh, good friends of mine, uh, Althea and Graham, uh, down in Stokes Valley, are celebrating uh, on the 9th their uh, 50th anniversary. So it would be uh, quite interesting to see uh, what songs were being played when uh, they were wed. Right, that's my uh, lot time to uh, disappear and uh, head back home and have an early night. You're tuned to uh, Arrow FM, your local community access radio station that broadcasts all over the wonderful wire wrapper on Arrow FM 92.7 and elsewhere via our website arrowfm.co.nz. And don't forget, you can also uh, catch programs uh, broadcast over Arrow FM being uh, televised through uh, Wire Rapper TV, which is Freeview Channel uh, number 41. The time now is four minutes after nine o'clock. Time for some commercial free Kiwi music.
got no job, no money coming in. Plenty of problems, nobody listening. Oh, come on, listen closely now. You got to make it through somehow. Ana, 
92.7, your community access radio station. This is where we will live. This is where we will die. There's no one to run to, no place to hide. There's nowhere to turn to.
Renting and raving And I'm
FM 92.7, brought to you in association with New Zealand On Air. Something that's eating 
Welcome once again to Upfront Soul. I'm your host, Sanguine Fromage, laying down 120 minutes of soulful sounds to which you may get down. I'm going to remind you that we do exist in the social media world. You can look us up on Facebook at Upfront Soul. Of course, that's a great way to communicate with us as well, sending us a message. If you would like to follow us, of course, we'd be honored. We do like to let you know what's coming up on future editions of Upfront Soul and keep you up to date on new releases, milestones in the funk, soul, and jazz world and also civil rights history. Uh, we are also on Twitter at Upfront Soul, and we occasionally foray into Instagram. Also, Upfront Soul. All right, well, this set is going out. Mm-hmm. 